Ethan, wake up! Mommy, we heard you say something about a surprise. I'm getting hungry. I want to eat by myself. Okay, kids, are you ready? Close your eyes. No peeking. <laughs> Aloha, everyone, and welcome back to our channel. It's morning, but Emma and Ethan are still sleeping. And I'm not going to wake them up just yet because I have a surprise for them. Do you want to see it? Okay, here it is. Love Your Bird Company sent us this really cool educational toy for free. And so I wanted to surprise Emma and Ethan with it today. After they wake up, dress up and have their breakfast, I wanted them to play with this new toy. They're growing up so fast and I think it's time for them to start learning some good things to get them ready for school, like colors and shapes, numbers and letters. And what is the best way to do that? then through play. So why don't we go and wake up Emma and Ethan? It's 7 o'clock already. Help them get ready for the day, have breakfast, and straight to learning and playing. Emma, Ethan, wake up! Oh, look at those sleepy heads, sleeping so cute with their bears. Let's go try to wake up Ethan. Come on, Ethan, wake up! We have to get ready for the day. Boy, it looks like Ethan is just as sleepy as his sister. Well, I'm going to put a little music on and see if it will help them wake up on their own. Well, good morning! Would you look who woke up? It's Emma and Ethan! Oh, look at you, Emma. Did you lose your little headband? Do you want it back on you? There we go. Mommy, we heard you say something about a surprise. Is there really a surprise? Yeah, I heard something about surprise too. Well, you're right. There is a surprise for you and it's a really fun one. But first, we have to get ready for the day. We need to change you, feed you, and only then we can open up the surprise. Yay! I can't wait! Me too! Okay, well, let me give you your outfits first. We'll change you, and then we'll head to our breakfast table. Okay, so here's what Emma's gonna be wearing today. A cute little onesie with a ducky, a cute little skirt, that matches her onesie, a matching headband, and cute ruffle socks. You wanna hold them, Emma? Yay, I love this outfit, Mommy. Good, very good. Now let's see what Ethan will wear. What am I gonna wear today? Well, for Ethan, we have a cute little panda onesie. Do you like it? Yeah, that's nice. And we'll pair it with these nice pants. I think that will look good. And matching socks. All right, kids, let's dress up. We're ready, Mommy. Oh, just look at you. You look so adorable. Look at Ethan, so handsome in that outfit. And Emma, you look stunning. I think you guys are ready for the day. Let's go have some breakfast. I'm getting hungry. Okay, let's go. Well, would you look at these two? They're definitely growing up. They have their own beds now and they're learning how to eat at the table. So that's exciting. Mommy, mommy, what are we having for breakfast? Yeah, I'm curious to know too. Well, for breakfast we're having cereal with bananas with your favorite spoons. Yay, that's my favorite! <laughs> I knew it! I also have some strawberries and apples. Who would like a strawberry and who would like an apple? Me! I would like a strawberry, please! Okay, here you go! And I like apples! Here you go, Ethan! You can also have some juice packs with orange juice and straws! 
And I have all kinds of animal biscuits for you. Thank you, Mommy. This is so yummy. Yes, I can't wait to eat. But I think we need some bibs. You're right. I have some bibs for you. Okay, ready? Let's eat. You want to try it yourself? Here we go, Emma. Mommy, I am a big girl now. I want to eat by myself. Well, you're right, Emma. You are a big girl. Go ahead and use your own spoon. up the table okay well let's go in our playroom and I'll show you your big surprise Yay! okay kids are you ready close your eyes no peeking Ta -da! open your eyes It's a special learning toy. There are nine different games in this one toy. So let's go ahead and explore. First of all, here on the front, you see some very cute gears. They're shaped like flowers. Isn't that so sweet? And I see a clock on my side. That's right, Ethan. Let's take a look at it. There's a colorful clock with our hand and second hand. And I can help you learn how to read the clock. And I see something fun on my side, too. What is it? Let's take a look. Look! It's an abacus. It helps you learn how to count. One, two, three, four, five. And it's all different colors. So you can learn colors at the same time. You want to try it, Emma? I like it. I thought you would. Oh, look, Mommy. I see something else in here. What is it? It's some kind of a tree. Oh, look! That's right. There's a game where you can put all these different things where they belong. Like the bird belongs right here by the nest. The bee should go probably over here. And the monkey all the way up to the tree. Wait, I can't see what you're playing with. Here you go, Ethan. You can look at that. While we look at this game. This is a shape sorter, and it helps you to learn shapes. I found something else fun. Look. What is it, Emma? Let's take a look. Oh, it's a game for counting. Look, it says one, house, two, cars, three, trains. Let me see that. It sounds like something I'd like. There you go, Ethan. Do you like to count? And here we are back to the clock. But that's not all. There are more games here. Where, Mommy? Well, they're hiding. Look at the top. If we pull the top up, look, we get a whole new game. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. These look like roller coasters, don't they? <laughs> Mommy, is there anything else in there? Let me see. Let me help you, Emma. There's a bag of fish and some fishing rods. Let's see how that works. I think you're supposed to put this back and then you can play your pond game here. But right now for us it would be easier to play just on the floor. Oh, there's all kinds of fishes here. And here are the two fishing rods. One for Emma and one for Ethan. Now let's take a look. What kind of fish do we have here? Ooh, this is a puffer fish, probably. That's a balloon fish, actually. Okay, the starfish. It tells you on the back what they are. But this is a lobster, a clownfish. Let's see, a little turtle, which we call honu in Hawaii. Butterfly fish. Ooh, look how pretty, Emma. Celestial fish. Oh, these are really fancy names. And look at this fish. It has a very long name, but I can't pronounce that. But you know what it looks like to me? What? 
This little fish looks like famous Hawaii States fish. Do you know what the name of it is? No, what is it? It's Humu Humu Nuku Nuku Pu'u A'a. <laughs> that is so funny! I know, Emma. It's a very long and funny name. But it's kind of cute too. Well, why don't you try to fish something out and see what will you get? Okay, let's see. What will you get? You got it! It's a clownfish! You want to hold it? Let's help you now. Oh! Wow, she was fast! What did you get? Pearl Grammy. I've never heard of such thing, but she looks beautiful. She is so cute! Ethan, you want to try again? Hey, <laughs> look, I got the Hawaii fish! What is the name of it again? That's right, you got the Humu Humu Nuku Nuku Pu'u A'a. Almost sounds like a song. <laughs> Here you go, Ethan. How about Emma? I'm gonna, I'm gonna get something really fun, really fun. Let me see. Ooh, wait, 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 let me get this one. Ah, ah. No, I didn't want a crab. I wanted this one. Wow, Emma, you got the most beautiful fish in the whole entire world. Look how cute and pink it is. But why don't we call it a princess fish? Yeah, I like that name. This fishing game is really fun, Mommy. Yes, I like it. It's my favorite. Well, I'm so glad you're enjoying it. But there's another game you can play. Let's open this up again. And by the way, you can just set it right here and play with this game standing up. Want to try it? Oh, look at you two. It seems all babies like this game when they're little. I'm not a baby anymore, but I still like it. Okay, well, let me show you one last game. So we take this off, we get what's left in here, which is some shapes for the shape sorter and some dice and things for a board game. But mommy, I don't see any board game. How are we gonna play that? Just wait. First, let me test you on your knowledge of shapes. Who can tell me what this is? It's a circle. You're right. How about this one? It's a square. You're right. And it goes right there. And this one is triangle. That's a funny name. That is a funny name. It means it has three sides. One, two, three. But now let's see the other game. First, let's put this back. And let's turn this toy upside down. And all of a sudden you have another game where you can play this board game and throw your dice. Whoops! We'll have to figure out how to play this game though. Wow, that sounds interesting. I would like to know how to play this game. Yeah, me too. But it looks a little bit complicated. Well, it does look a little complicated, but I'm sure we can figure it out. Well, friends, I just wanted to mention that this awesome toy was sent to us by Love Ye Vert. And here's a little instruction that I found inside. It's a wooden bead maze for ages 18 months and plus. It has nine games in it and it's super fun. If any of you parents are interested in this little toy, then check out the links in the description below. I'll have all the information there. Special thank you to Love You Vert for sending this awesome toy to us. And thank you Emma and Ethan for helping me explore it. I think Emma and Ethan are growing up so fast and they will learn so much just by playing this awesome toy. Do you have a favorite toy that you always like to play with? Write us in the comments below. If you like this video, please give us thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of our new videos. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Say bye, kids. Bye-bye.